Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to do a video um, showing you guys how I've been kind of teaching Leela to swim. So she is not a natural swimmer at all. It's been quite a struggle. I've gotten a lot of bruises and scratches from her, but I wanted to just kind of go over, over it. So first of all, I do have a life jacket on her and I'm just working on getting her into the water. As you can see, I've been able to get her onto like the first step which will go in pretty pretty well, but getting her further is 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 really hard. So I've been kind of going into the water with her, um, and then actually this is some footage from today. As you can see, things have gotten um, a lot better. Um, so basically, I'm throwing it in, and she actually now has has been going in so much better. And I have a leash over her neck, and then I attached a leash to her life jacket so that I can support her um, and have her and help her. So here she's just kind of swimming back, but you can see like her legs kind of sink and she splashes a lot, but at least now she's going in and she has a goal of getting um, that toy. Whereas before when I threw the toy in and tried to make her go in, she was so scared that she would kind of go in and turn right back around and she didn't care that the toy was there. So the biggest thing about like dog training is like if your dog will play, that means your dog is not fearful. Fearful dogs don't play or take treats. So the fact that she's playing um, and she's, you know, has a mission to get that um, floater means that she's not scared. She's obviously not a good swimmer, as you guys can see. But hey, she's she's way better. So you can see with my leash, I'm like lifting her bum up and, and just kind of helping her. So yeah, so it's come a long way. Um, basically, it used to be that, you know, I was in the water with her um, and now I'm able to help her by being on the side with her. Um, and you can see like she's having fun, you know, she's splashing like crazy, but um, she, she's just doing so much better. So my goal is for her to obviously, you know, be better at swimming with her legs, you know, supporting herself. But <clears throat> this is after about two weeks, guys. Um, I've been at this not much. She's probably had maybe five or six swim lessons with me. Not much, like 15 minutes at a time. I didn't want to overwhelm her. But like you can see, like she's having fun, you know, she's getting her toy. And when she comes out, she feels so proud. Um, and I'm just so happy about that, you know. Um, she's just doing so much better. So I'm going to keep working with her. But I just wanted you to guys kind of see, you know, if you have a dog that doesn't want to go into the water, you can make them. It's hard, but you can. Um, so here you see, I threw it and I wanted to see if she'd go in by herself. And she's not. She's kind of, she wants to, but she's stuck on the landing there. Um, but you can see like in a second, I'm going to help her and give her a little bit of a, you know, support in. And then there she goes by herself. I'm not holding on to her. She looks crazy, <laughs> but she's having fun, you know, like, so I'm going to help her out and give her the toy. There we go. And most importantly, she knows how to get out of the pool. So I taught her, you know, the first thing I taught her was like the exit the in and out. I'm just so proud of her here. But I basically, you know, taught her how to get in and out. And that's really important, guys, because if you have a pool and your dog ever like accidentally falls in, you know, dogs drown because they don't know how to get out. So if you can teach your dog just how to get out, like where the steps are, that's gonna, um, like that's a game changer. So yeah, I just wanted to show you this video, guys. It was a lot of hard work, like I said. Um, she's not a natural swimmer, but look where we are. So with persistence, um, you can do it. Um, you just have to, you know, make them go in. Um, and then eventually, you know, they will get more comfortable. Anyways, I hope you guys like this quick little video. Um, let me know if you have any comments below, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!